Hello everybody, my name is here, I'm founder of CIO at Worky, and today we're going to show you how you can simply manage your clients with Worky in one single place. Okay, let's start from our Worky account. As you can see, I already logged in in my Worky account and I can uh, on the dashboard page and let's go to the contacts page. Okay, so uh, here on the contacts page, you will see all your clients that you added to Worky. Uh, you can simply sort them by letters, just tapping on some uh, letter you have and by categories as well. Uh, there are actually three different ways of how you can add your clients to work. Let's start from the most simplest one of create manual uh, contact here. You can just create new here. You will be able to add name of your client, email, some notes like categories and add some additional information like uh, addresses, social media accounts, companies, etc. Et uh, the second way of adding clients to your work is just synchronizing your contacts from your uh, Google account. Uh, we highly recommend you to connect your work account to your Google account. In this case, you'll be able to see all your meetings from Google Calendar in your work calendar you will be able to synchronize your contacts and you will be able to connect google meet as a video call provider as well uh, i already have my google account connected so i can just simply click here and i can see all my clients from my uh, google account here i can just simply tap on plus button close this window and after this this uh, contact will be automatically added to my work account Okay, and let's talk about the third way, it's automatic way. Uh, let's go to website and let's open our website. Once you're sharing your personal website with working with your clients and once some client books you for the first time, we will automatically create this client for you in your working account. So you do not need to uh, worry about that things. We are doing that for you automatically. Okay, so this is the third way. Uh, and now let's go to our contacts page and now let's create some demo contact with you, okay? Let's tap on create new and let's do send of kind of Brad Smith. We already have this. Let's do brademail.com, like some test data. Let's do I met uh, Brad uh, on, the, on the conference. Okay, so we have just added some note here. We can also select category. Let's do some kind of personal uh, and uh, let's do additional details. We can also add address here, some phone, social media and company. Let's do brand and call. Okay, so we already have this inf information. We can just tap on save. Cool, we already have this contact here. Uh, since you do not have any traction with this call contact, yet you'll see new mark here now let's move forward and let's uh, see how our contact looks like so we see that we already uh, connect uh, we already created this bread uh, client in your client management system is working you, you can see all the basic information here like bread smith uh, some comment etc and here you will see a couple of simple dashboards financial review here you will see all the, all the information regarding your financial traction with this client uh, all your invoices uh, paid by bread will be shown here and you will be also see to you will be also able to see all your paid time slots with bread as well here on session already you will be able to see uh traction of your sessions like all how many uh sessions you had how many time you spent with bread etc etc and also last sessions recent notes etc let's go, go to the content information here you will be able to add some detailed information about bread right and on session and notes uh pages you will be also able to see all your sessions and notes history now let's move back to your contacts page and let's uh, let me show you how uh, your contact could look like once you already have some traction. Uh, uh, let's go to this contact. Igor Born, this kind of uh, test client I have. As you can see, I had some financial transaction with this client before in January, in March, in uh, July as well. So uh, Worky will show me all my financial traction with this client over the last 12 months. I can also see all my session history with this client. I can see uh, how many sessions were completed, uh, how many are G and uh, how many sessions were canceled and also see quarter and yearly information about uh, sessions as well. 
Okay, so now let's uh, try to play with this contact, maybe create some random session with this contact and let's see how it looks like. Uh, let's do create session. I can do Igor Born, uh, for example, for September 27th and for kind of 5.30 p.m. Uh, save. Okay, uh, okay, so we already have, uh, yes, some small error, I don't know why, but anyway, <laughs> we have already this session edit. Let's go to sessions page and let's go to the bottom. Yeah, as you can see, we have this session edit for September 27th uh, with this client. We can also go to this session and as you can see, with Worky, you can jump to your call uh, directly from this page. You can also reschedule a meeting with this client. You can also cancel your meeting with this client uh, by adding some reason. And you can also uh, add some artifacts, for example, payment. For example, this session will pay to you like by cash or any other way. So you can just mark this information for your convenience by tapping here. Uh, okay. And adding price for the session like 100 bucks save. In this case, we will just save this information here for your convenience. So you won't forget about that. So this is how you can uh, simply create a session uh, with your client uh, and manage the session as well right from here we can also uh, reschedule this se session for example let's reschedule for september 30 let's do at 7 p.m uh sorry i have to reschedule uh, and in this case we'll be able just simply reschedule this, se this session from this this page okay let me correct my typo and send request okay so as you can see this session is already rescheduled uh, you and your client will receive email notification about the session being rescheduled for new time and you'll be also able to see uh, information about the rescheduled session uh, right from here all right now we can also add some notes to the session for example let's do note uh, for session 28 uh, Hey, Igor, this is note for our session. So you uh, you can create a note for you, for the upcoming appointments that you have. And uh, uh, this note will be visible only for you. And uh, this kind of, you can add some small things, uh, some reminders uh, for you. Just do not forget about the appointment. Okay. Uh, we already have this note here. Now let's go back to our client page. As you can see, we already have one session due here. We already have our recent note here added and we already have our financial uh, dashboard as well. Let's go to contact information, sessions and notes. As you can see, we, you can just tap on note and see this note that we just added with you. Okay, and uh, you can also hop to this session directly from this page. Just tap on sessions, go to sessions page and tap on join now. And in this case, you'll be able to hop to session with your client right from this page. Okay, let's go back. Okay, so we just uh, discussed with you how you can, uh, how you can create uh, clients with Worky, how you can synchronize clients and how clients are being created in your work account automatically with our smart uh, automation system with Worky. You can also see how uh, you can manage clients, how you can add information and how smart dashboards with Worky looks like for financial information and for session information as well. From this page, by the way, you can also send invoice, uh, create uh, schedule appointments with this client, add some information uh, about this client, etc., etc. So uh, we made it very simple for you to uh, synchronize your clients, to uh, manage your clients from one single place. Stay tuned. We are preparing a lot of great updates for this functionality and I really believe you find it useful feel free to reach me directly in case you have any questions about our client management system i'll be really uh, thankful for your feedback and uh, stay tuned you can reach me by ehor at worky.net with my personal uh, worky email address and i really hope this video was helpful for you uh, stay tuned and uh, see you soon bye bye